yeah uh, students now we will see uh, one more type one more typical type of uh, problems in in uh, lines cases and this is uh, the uh, problem where one end is in hp and another end is in vp right so here uh, this is a very simple kind of problem where you can uh, try in this rotating line method so draw the line draw the draw the draw the projections of a straight line ab 100 mm long so the true length is given 100 mm inclined at 45 degrees to hp so theta is 45 degree phi is 35 degree 30 degree to vp and uh, from up to here it is a very normal problem and here if you see the end a is in hp and the other end b is in vp so that is the uh, typical problem that is why it is typical problem you can easily solve this right so one end is in hp right end a is in hp when the end a is in hp its front view right when the end is end a is in hp front view front view will be on xy reference line so this will be your a dash so this is your a dash front view is a dash so from a dash you just draw a thin line so already i am getting a dash so somewhere on this line on this projector i am going i am going to get my a right point a so that i can decide now right so another end is another end b is in vp so when b is in vp in top view you can see on xy reference line so b you can see on xy reference line right you can you can draw a line right so you set the drafter right so here the drafter plays a major role right you set the drafter at 30 degrees to vp right so you set the drafter the longer scale of the drafter you set it at 30 degrees to vp right 30 degrees to xy reference line so if you set it right this will become this will become your b point sorry a this is this is your point a so this angle is 30 degree right so this is your b dash and b2 dash right so b2 so b2 and b2 dash so this point itself is your b2 and b2 dash both right since b is on hp right so b is on vp right a b is on vp so now this point is b2 and b2 dash so this is your locus of a and this is the locus of b right this is the locus of b and b dash both so this is the locus of a dash right so this is the locus of b dash so this is the locus of b sorry it is the locus of b and locus of b dash you will get here right locus of b dash you get here so at 45 degree right at 45 degree you draw a line at, at 45 degree you draw a line right with 100 mm long right so this is 100 mm long this will become your b1 dash right so this is your b1 dash and b1 dash a dash b1 dash right this line you drop down up to locus of a this is our usual practice right so now a b1 as radius you rotate up to the locus of b locus of b and this is your final b right so this is your final b this becomes your top view so this is your top view and now you 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 rotate this a dash b2 dash right and now rotate up to locus of b dash you will get the b dash so this is your a dash and b dash so this is the a dash and b dash and now you cross check your answer both will be lying on the same projector now you check this is a dash is on hp and b as b is on uh, vp right a is on hp b is on vp right so this is how you should proceed in this problem so without drafter without uh, without marking this 30 degree line you cannot proceed in this problem otherwise you may have to proceed in three separate steps that is also possible
right but this is uh, the, this method will save you more time also because no need to measure each and every time and no need to replicate it right whereas in uh, here we can rotate directly you can rotate and you can get the answer so this is one problem of this kind another problem we will we will see of the same right so a line 100 mm long has its lower end in hp and the upper end in vp right one end is on hp another end is on vp its plan and elevation measures 80 mm 70 mm respectively so here the plan and the elevation is given instead of theta and pi right in earlier problem we had theta and pi whereas here we are getting the final measurements final front view on top view draw the projections of the line and find its true inclinations with hp and vp so theta and phi also we need to find and this is xy reference line it is also very similar to earlier problem and uh, one one end is on hp so lower end is on hp so when it when the lower end is on hp it uh, it means that uh, point a we can uh, consider it as point a and in front view we can see the point a on xy reference line so this will become our a dash right so a dash and uh, the front view is given so that distance is b2 and b2 dash and uh, that is nothing but your 70 mm right the elevation is 70 mm right and uh, with this with this uh, the true length is given right true length is 100 mm now b2 as center right and on a dash line on this projector you cut the line so in previous case we had angle right with respect to vp whereas here we have only the distance true length true length is nothing but 100 mm so from b2 b2 point right so b2 is nothing but this is your a dash and b2 dash and same point is your b2 also because this is the locus of b line right so now b2 as center the 100 mm as radius cut the arc cut the arc so this is your 100 mm right 100 mm and now from a right from a from a you measure 80 mm right you measure 80 mm that is nothing but elevation so this is the elevation to get elevation right on this line so on this line you are going to have the b1 dash so this is this will become your b1 right b1 and if you cut the line right uh, if you cut the line on this line 100 mm 100 mm right you are going to get 100 mm and you are going to get b1 dash right so this is b1 dash this is b1 now we have to rotate this till locus of b to get your b point right now take this point right take a as center right a as center a, a b1 as radius a b1 as radius right you cut the arc you cut the arc so this will become your your top view this is your final top view this is your final top view now a dash b2 dash as radius a dash as center you rotate this arc till you get you it touches the locus of b dash so now this will become your b dash right this is your b dash and this is your true length line this is your true length line sorry this is your front view front view line and this is your theta and this is your phi so this is your phi and measure both and write as answer i am getting theta equal to 37 degree phi equal to 45 degree right so this is the kind of problem where one end is in hp another end is in vp so this is how you should solve this uh, type of problems where uh, you can proceed in three different steps also but this will give you a very simple way right uh, it uh, saves times time also so you can proceed in the same rotating line method we will see a few more uh, problems and uh, there is a kind of problem uh, midpoint it is a midpoint problem uh, we will discuss those type of problems